We are here at the world famous Dream Street. Made famous by us. <laughs> <laughs> Made <laughs> famous by uh, Santa, Santa Rita, Rita. <laughs> and Horn. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Horn. Uh, we are standing in front of the Weston, mm -hmm. and well, Weston, the builder, and the plan is, why don't you break it down for us then? The plan is the newly revamped uh, Rowan 3. So they just redid this floor plan and added some more square footage, and this home here, this beautiful model home that you see, is going to be about 3,700 square feet, and pricing is going to be from the mid, actually from the low to the mid 800. So. Um, we're going to take you inside and show you around and show you this beautiful, great, entertaining home. Yeah, there's some really cool features that you want to see. This rotunda, the staircase, this cool little bar area. We're about to get I into it. I love the bar area. You ready to go check it out? Yep, let's go. Let's go. Welcome home indeed. What up with that staircase? I know, right when you walk in, it is just beautiful and grand. Sets All right. this house up. Do me a favor, like, subscribe, hit that bell, get notified, please, because we love having you guys here to serve, bringing you Liberty Hill content. It's what we do. It's what we do. We try to anyway. We try. It's what we try to do. So ensuite bedroom here in the Rowan 3. For your, I don't know, out of town guest, family member, kid coming home from school, child that you want to put in time out, whatever it is. <laughs> no, <better>. because then <laughs> they get too much privacy up here. Yeah, they're never coming out. <laughs> so uh, front of the house, ensuite bathroom, bed, ensuite away. bedroom, tucked away, right? And now we're going to go into this office here and uh, super sizable, pretty generous. It's got that window seat, lots of light. They took the blinds off for kind of effect I here. I think it's a window seat. I think that's a... Oh, is it? Filing cabinet. I'm sorry. Is that a filing cabinet? I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm doing most days. But those are nice built-ins <laughs> and beautiful doors. <laughs> oh my gosh, these ceilings, y'all. I think I'm in church right now. I'm waiting for the organ to start playing. I it's know. Amazing. It is just grand. I think out of all the homes that we've seen in this price point, this home probably has the most wow factor. Yeah, it's got a lot of features. They cram a ton in this amazing yeah. space. I mean, these are like all beautiful custom like features, like the, the ceilings, the ceiling treatments, the uh, the fireplace, and then the shelving, the floating shelves, uh, cabinets to the uh, right and left, either side of the fireplace. And everything all goes all beautiful. the way up. I yes. mean, this house and, really feels grand. Yeah, Sorry, and the, no, it's okay. Those lights up top, those uh, window lights have let everything in. Um, well, the lights, we call them lights, but they're windows, those three windows up top to allow even more light in just for effect and just kind of panning across the space here. You can really see that they have put a ton in. By the way, that flooring is hardwood, engineered floored, uh, har Beautiful engineered hardwood. Floors. It is not the LVP. Okay. This who is wants probably a, my favorite. Who wants Other a margarita? Other than the ceilings in the living room, <laughs> that's <laughs> probably my favorite little feature. I love that little bar area. It's so cute. Yeah, I know, and it's I love like it. perfectly placed. And you can just tell that this home is meant for entertaining. Yeah. I mean, can, just this huge open space, this right. ginormous living room, this little bar area. Just tons of seating, and then you got your bathroom. Yeah, so right you can here. drink so as you're... much as you want because the bathroom is right there. Your guests can go potty <laughs> when they need a break. <laughs> so go back, going back to that bar area, it is really cool. So the placement is amazing. So you can have your activities. Dining room is there. Living is just to the right. Kitchens to the left. Open those three panel doors. Go right into the yard. Have a beautiful space outside. This is really set up, as you mentioned, just to really have people gather and have a blast in a great environment that's just meant to entertain. And it just continues to go up and up and up, really adding to the grand feel. And this kitchen, can we just say, wow. Yeah, yeah, wow, right? It's yeah. amazing, very cool, very well done. It so, feels very custom. Appliances are KitchenAid in that. Uh, in this kitchen. Of course, these are all upgrades. If you want quartz that looks like calicotta marble, then you're going <laughs> to have to pay for that upgrade, but it's possible and it's here for your eye candy. <laughs> That's right. They put it all here for you to enjoy. That looks like Zalige tile. It does. But it, it is, is not. not Zalige. If you guys don't know what Zalige tile is, they are handmade tiles 
um, out of clay and they are made in Morocco. Mm. Um, these, because liege is so popular right now, um, and it's just the classic look. It's, it's like faux liege. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. You like that? Very clever. Yeah, baby. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go right down the hall on and the pantry's left. pantry's right there on yep. the left. That pantry. door right there. I didn't go in the pantry, but that's okay. So we have the mud room, and we have uh, just a, a really kind of cozy little area. Come in, drop your bag. And you know, in a lot of houses, the mud room is really kind of visible. Here it's tucked Not away. Way. If you have a mess, nobody can see it. Yeah. And then you go into this laundry space and there's dual level cabinets or countertops. So you have your sink, super nice. And then you have your countertop over the washer and dryer. Yes, that's Fold nice laundry, feature. do whatever you need to. And then yeah. tons of storage in there. Off the owner suite, we have this entry exit space, the door there. Uh, and that's actually right outside the owner suite door. And you go in and bam, lots of space. Beautiful room, yeah, very large, very tray ceiling, room. tongue and groove ceiling, uh, finish out up top there. It's a little too hot in Texas for a chandelier. Yeah, <laughs> I just I'd agree. Say it. I Summer's gotta, getting really hot. I appreciate the I feel the like look. you need a ceiling fan. Oh, I, I mean, the designer in me loves the ceiling or the chandeliers, of course, but practically <laughs> it's a little hot. Yeah, but it's gorgeous. Practically, they did a wonderful job. I'm gonna here sweat my butt off. It's about to be <laughs> how it is in here. So very cool though. It's a lo lovely feel. All right, this yep. owner's vanity. bathroom, double vanity, detached tub. tub. Yep, and then we have. Spin around, you have that inset shower. So the um, inset, the inset shower, you step down into it. That's a that's a lovely feature. You'll never flood. You know, if you have that kind of shower that's down, you step down into it. That's a actually a very nice upgrade. It's almost a custom upgrade. So that's something that you can do in here as well. Uh, with the glass doors and so forth. Yeah. Very and lovely. And we're about to go thing. into this closet. It's almost like I'm in the stock room at Banana Republic or something. <laughs> I used to work at Pottery Barn. You remember that? <laughs> that a long time ago. It's a funny story. We both applied and I got the job and she's the designer. <laughs> All right. Well, so, I didn't do design back then. But, yeah, and that's but anyways, going back. Sorry. Closet. closet is legit. Yeah. Closet Look. actually feels, or when you're actually in the home, it's it feels really large. Yeah, um, sure. Here in the video, you can't really tell, but they finished it out really well, mm -hmm. and it's nice and clean. You know, I can see all your hats on top of that top. Show. <laughs> Love your hats. Or bags or, I don't know, whatever. And, or bags, and back and into this laundry here. space. Yep, and then we're gonna go out, and here, we're gonna get the, cus the, the you know, the, the obligatory, way okay. too close to my wife. Come on. Shot. I'm so sorry. I'm so <laughs> sorry. Sorry, y'all. Right about here, I realized, and I like put the camera away. <laughs> I do apologize. <laughs> Everybody at home is blushing. I'm super sorry. <laughs> Oh, so, all right, we're going to take a look back at this oh, staircase here with the rotunda above it. And man, what a classic grand addition to really crown the house, especially when you walk right in, you can see this beautiful entryway. Yeah, look at that. That's lovely. Yeah, this home has a lot of traditional features or uh, tra excuse me, transitional features. Um, there's a lot of traditional things going on, but then it also feels very contemporary and they've just melded the two together very yeah, well. Seamlessly, it's very nice. This area up here, you, obviously they have the pool table and then you can do a ping pong table, air hockey, whatever it is you wanna do. Maybe put a, a small couch there, put another TV on the wall. I don't know, something like that. This is just a bonus space that's really cool. And then right down this little corner here, you have a niche kind of pocket work area mm -hmm. and there's a crazy person sitting at the desk getting some work done. <laughs> <laughs> but I love that. I love that they <laughs> utilized that space really well and added that in there because, you know, it's just a little quiet nook for somebody to get some schoolwork done. Or, yeah, and if they would have you know, made that whole thing need. theatered, it may have been too big. Yeah, I right? agree, so, for sure. way to break it up. Good job for Weston for recognizing that. It may have been kind of that awkward, too, not too big enough, not, you know, too maybe too small otherwise. So. They did a great job kind of separating that, putting the other side of the wall as a workstation and then making this a theater. So very cool setup yeah, there. It's a sweet little media room. I like it. It really is. And then the guitar pick coffee tables, you notice that? I did. <laughs> okay, back out here, get a great view down into the living oh, area. There's those ceilings again. Dude, Gosh, so those legit. ceiling treatments. Ugh, oh, love yep. it. I feel like I'm in Notre Dame. It's or something. just so grand. It's awesome. It's beautiful. And then we have the two bedrooms. So there's two bedrooms on the main level. And then we have two bedrooms up, and then of course you have the office on the main level as well. So you walk in and everything is so spaced out. Like on the main level you have that ensuite bedroom when you first walk in. Then you have your owner suite in the back corner of the house. But then up top you have your two guest beds. 
connected through this very Jack functional here. Jack and Jill. So the doorway goes out into the hallway. You could come in, just wash your hands, or you can lock that and have privacy if you're in the bedroom and then into the throne room here with the shower, which is a really cool connection. And I do this sweet, like super like agile, like backup camera move oh here. Can I just, gracious. can I tell you that like, I should be up for an Emmy or something like this? What he it. didn't tell you is that he tripped and fell right there. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. The <laughs> editing is amazing on this thing. I edited out my complete calamity. Oh, this uh, is a great size bedroom though. I mean, look at that. I think that's a king's, is that a king's? No, that's a queen, but look how much space there is. That's, that's a, a great size for a, you know, secondary bedroom. Yep, that's a very generously sized, very cool view down into the yard. Yep, there you go, generously sized. What? <laughs> okay, let's go down these stairs. We're going to go super quick. Ready? Whoa! <laughs> I love that. I was... I was no, uh, no, ragging on Keith for, oh. for always saying generously oh, sized better. ragging. I thought you said bragging. I should have known better. <laughs> ragging on Keith. All right, outdoor living space. We have this beautiful uh, area here. Very generously sized. Oh, my god! And uh, we ha it's blocked out for two ceiling fans, which is a cool little feature. And, of course, there's that side door that goes into the area right off the owner's suite. You have enough room here for, I think, this sits six people, seat six people, but then there's that additional fire, uh, fire pit, fire um, place okay. over there that's kind of shield, shielded by the by the wall. And I man. I do like that hexagon tile that they used out there too. Yes, it's very nice. Nice work designers of West End. Great job, West End. We love this plan and man, it is just a, a beautiful property. So Definitely want to make sure that you guys get to take a look at this one. If you guys have any questions about Liberty Hill or anything at all that we can do for you, let us know. Otherwise, we will see, see you around, around the, the hill. hill.